After leaving winter, Nam Taehyun has stayed in the shadows until very recently. Over the past few days, some weird and disturbing allegations about him came out, and in today's video, we dive deep to look at everything that happened. Nam Taehyun debuted with winter in 2014, and since then, his career has been quite rocky. Just a few months after their debut, Taehyun got into a controversy revolving around his alleged rude behavior towards fans. During one of their concerts, Winner's leader was greeting the fans when Taehyun informally shouted, he's speaking. His behavior was deemed as disrespectful because of his casual way of talking. Taehyun released an apology in which he stated that he's someone who wants their fans to feel comfortable around them, so that's why he spoke to them in an informal way. It seems like this was just the beginning of bad news because Taehyun didn't stay in Winner for too long. In November of 2016, shocking news of Taehyun departing from Winner and leaving YG Entertainment made the headlines. An executive from YG stated that he went through lengthy discussions with Taehyun, and both parties concluded that it would be too difficult for him to continue activities with Winner, and that his exclusive contract got terminated a week prior to the announcement. The executive also stated that the reason for Taehyun's departure were ongoing struggles with his mental health. Prior to his departure, Taehyun halted his activities in October of 2016 and went on a hiatus, as Winner postponed the upcoming comeback. YG's executive shared that it was too difficult to determine when Taehyun would be able to return since the psychological issue was something that he had been dealing with from a very young age. After departing from Winner, Taehyun established the group South Club. Then, in 2018, South Club released the song Outcast, and that's when a lot of rumors started to come out. Some netizens claim that the song talks about Taehyun's bad relationship with the rest of the members, and they think that it was the reason why he left. However, Taehyun clarified that the song had nothing to do with the members. He emphasized that all the members had kind personalities, and that they all acted in a rational way. Taehyun then went on to share the reason why he left YG. He stated, What I can say is that I didn't leave because of one specific incident. I'm saying that I didn't leave because I caused a big problem. Now keep this in mind because it's important information for what we will talk about in just a second. Numerous times, Taehyun shared that the reason why he left was his mental health slowly getting worse and worse, and also because he wanted to make a different type of music. He said that he doesn't regret leaving Winner at all. The situation started started to get more complicated in 2019, when netizens revisited some of his old statements. In 2018, Taehyun shared a post on his social media that said, If I ever went into detail about the reason I left, do you think I'd be the one negatively affected by it? Shut up while I keep it quietly buried. His departure from Winner started to seem suspicious more than ever. Especially back then, when Icon's BI was embroiled in a scandal. Judging by what has been revealed on August 23rd of 2022, there's a possibility that Taehyun has been been lying all this time. YouTuber Lee Jin Ho posted a video on August 22nd in which he claimed that Taehyun was actually kicked out of YG because of the ongoing controversies and behind the scenes issues. Lee Jin Ho said, The reason why YG kicked Nam Taehyun out is because the situation was at the point where staff members were having a hard time dealing with him. He also added that back then, not only the staff, but also officials felt like it was extremely difficult to deal with him. Lee Jin Ho continued, The big and small incidents surrounding Nam Taehyun can continued endless, and the critical moment came when Nam Taehyun brought his girlfriend to Winner's dorm. The YouTuber claimed that this was the point when the agency decided to kick him out. Another thing that Lee Jin Ho found weird was Taehyun's claim that it was difficult to stay in the music industry because of his struggles with mental health, but Taehyun established Social Club two months after he left Winner and the agency. Now all these suspicions and conspiracies about his departure from Winner and the company rose amid another controversy that Taehyun has been facing. This one revolves around his ex-girlfriend and and some heavy accusations. Let's start from the beginning. Taehyun and his ex-girlfriend Jung Jae-in announced their relationship in April of 2019. Taehyun's agency then confirmed the relationship and stated that the two got close while filming the show Studio Vibes for TVN. Much like Taehyun's career, this relationship didn't go without complications. Not even two months after their relationship was made public, Jae-in accused Taehyun of cheating on her in a series of posts on her Instagram. One post was full of screenshots of cacao conversations between Taehyun and a woman nicknamed A. The second post contained screenshots of Instagram messages between Jaehyun and A. In the first post between Taehyun and A, A accused Taehyun of lying to her about breaking up with his girlfriend a month before. A claimed that her friend saw him with Jaehyun at a movie theater, and in response, Taehyun claimed that his relationship with Jaehyun was open and ambiguous. In those messages, Taehyun claimed that A told him that she wanted to be in a relationship with him, to which A replied that she wanted to be in a relationship with Taehyun only if she broke up with his girlfriend. In the conversation between A and Jaehyun, A sent Jae 
in what seemed to be screenshots of her conversations with Taehyun. In those messages, A apologized for being with Taehyun since she didn't know that the two were still seeing each other, despite Taehyun being with A. Then Jaein changed her Instagram bio to, All the rumors about you were real. I know it's not just one. Thank you for letting me speak out. Don't let any man control you. So yeah, it got messy. Then Taehyun posted an apology for stirring up trouble, and while he offered his deepest apologies to Jaein, he didn't forget to mention that the media basically published things that weren't true and didn't even bother to fact check. Then in June of 2019, Taehyun and Jaein decided to make amends following the cheating scandal. Jaein shared that they resolved the conflict after talking about it, and she wished him well in the future and his career as well. All seemed well, but the reality is, is that this wasn't the end. In April of 2020, Taehyun spoke about the cheating incident again. During a YouTube show, Taehyun was asked about the cheating scandal, and he responded with, It wasn't cheating. It's true that I was the cause of the breakup, but I met the other person while we were broken up. From what we know from the media articles, it seems like Taehyun cheated on Jaein while they were still together. This, of course, got a reaction out of Jaein and said, If you say something unbelievable one more time or involve me in any way, I will issue a strong response on the level of my agency. It seemed like Jaein was truly upset by what Taehyun said and just wanted the issue to be over. But as of right now, Taehyun is facing something much more serious than just a cheating scandal. On August 20th of 2022, So Min Jae, who was a contestant on the show Heart Signal 3, accused Taehyun of using illegal substances and even physically hurting her. She shared her story through a series of posts on her Instagram. She uploaded a selfie with Taehyun and wrote the caption, Nam Taehyun does fill upon. The needle he used is either in my room or in my office cabinet, and he hits me. While this specific selfie has already been deleted, Min Jae uploaded several other pictures of herself and Taehyun, and each time she said something different. Min Jae also shared that she has a recording on her phone, but didn't specify what's on the recording. Finally, she stated that at one point, the two were in love with each other. Min Jae and Taehyun have known each other for quite some time. They opened up a bar called Unison and Itaewon together, and Min Jae is also an influencer and a Hyundai Motors engineer. On August 21st, an official from the Seoul Yongsan police station shared that they have begun an internal investigation into the possibility of Taehyun using the substances. For whatever reason, really shortly after the news of the police investigation broke out, Min Jae took to her Instagram to claim that her original accusations were all fake. According to her, it was the result of a fight that took place between them after she had taken too much medication. Min Jae wrote, I had taken more psychiatric medications than the appropriate amount due to stress, and I was in a state of loss of reason to the point that I can't remember exactly what happened now. On August 26th of 2022, it was revealed that Min Jae and Taehyun have been taken into custody because of suspected illegal substance use. They have been called in for investigation and questioning to determine if they've ever taken something illegal. This case keeps on getting more and more confusing, but hopefully the truth will come out soon. That's it for today. What do you think about this case? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Bye!